overcome by the word of your testimony. Let us beautify our day with inspiration from God's word by reading today, Secret of Success. The title of today's article is, Overcome by the word of your testimony. And our opening verse is from the book of Revelation chapter 12 verse 11, which says, And they overcame him by the blood of the Lamb, and by the word of their testimony, and they loved not their lives unto the death. Revelation chapter 12 verse 11. One of the tricks that the devil uses against God's children to cheat them out of God's blessings is to question or bring doubt about that which God has done in their life. It's like what transpired right after the baptism of Jesus at the Jordan. God spoke out of heaven and said this is my beloved Son, in whom I am well pleased, Matthew chapter 3 verse 17. Immediately, Satan came to Jesus and asked if thou be the Son of God, command that these stones be made bread, Matthew chapter 4 verse 3. He tried to counter the very word God spoke about Jesus. But the master was smarter, he pushed Satan off with the word. That's what you need to do when Satan comes to you with his lies and railing accusations, use the word against him. Some Christians sometimes find themselves in a situation where, right after testifying of a miracle or a prophecy they received from the Lord, everything seems to turn upside down. For example, someone received healing and went ahead to testify openly of his miracle. Shortly after, the same symptoms he used to experience came back and became even more severe. That's an attack from the enemy, testing your confidence in what God has done in your life. At such times, what you ought to do is to maintain your testimony. You keep your victory shout on and refuse to allow those symptoms to rob you of the healing you've received. Overcome the lies of the devil by the word of your testimony. Let's confess this confession together. Speak this after me, believing in your heart with simple faith. Dear Father, I thank you for your word, which is infallible and ever dependable. My confidence is in the word of God, and my heart is established upon the truth of who I am in Christ Jesus – a victor, an overcomer, and one in whom divinity dwells and reigns. I stand firm on the word today in triumph, against the tricks of the devil. In Jesus' name, let's say Amen. If you are new to our YouTube channel, don't forget to subscribe and turn on the bell notification, and if you are watching us on Facebook don't forget to follow the page of Pastor Akar Zion Bipari. This will help you get notified as soon as we bring another dose of inspiration for you. Also, don't forget to visit our website, secretofsuccess.org. We would like to thank our partners for joining hands with us financially in making this broadcast possible. You can also become a proud partner with us, in beautifying and changing the lives of men and women around the world. Check the description, or visit the website for more details. Also feel free to drop your testimony or prayer requests, in the comment section, we would join our faith in prayer with you that God may be glorified in your life. Keep moving ahead in life, and God bless you.